ሰውኛ በተፈጠሩ የታደል ህዝቦች ነን ትንሽ መንፈሳችንን ሰብሰብ አርገን ውስታችንን አረጋግተን አንድ ሆነን ብለፋ በንሰራ ለኢትዮጵያ ተርፉ ለሌሎች የሚበቃ ነገር እንዳለን የሚያሳይ በጣም ብዙ ምልክቶች አሉ። ለሚሰራው ፕሮጀክት ሁሉ የኢትዮጵያን ከፍታ አሁን ካለበት ወደ የሚቀጥለው ደረጃ የሚወስድ ነው። My naturally endowed Ethiopia. This country is graced with all natural attributes. The frost, the highlands, the temperate zones, the lowlands and the desert all grace Ethiopia. The only task that awaits Ethiopia is to utilize these enormous resources for its grand aspiration of development and prosperity. That's why it's said that the way we perceive and utilize space requires a paradigm shift. Today, this place is one that we can immerse ourselves in nature and experience a template of Ethiopia in one place. Unfortunately, this was a place where waste materials were dumped in the past. Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed's novel ideas have turned this area from garbage dump into a field of colorful plants. All types of natural wonders come together here in this place, Unity Park Botanical Center. This Unity Park Botanical Center contains plants grown in all climate conditions of Ethiopia. The Botanical Center is also a site where plants are preserved for research, education, environmental protection, and visit in greenhouses. This botanical field represents the temperate zone of Ethiopia. Anset or false banana, coffee, courage, rue, and other demonstrate temperate zone. As a botanical center is a place where plants are preserved and passed on from generation to generation, it's a critical space to maintain biodiversity in times that climate change is challenging our world. The center will serve as a convenient center of knowledge for researchers conducting study on plants. The Unity Park Botanic Center, which was built by the sons and daughters of Ethiopia, is also where many have invested their knowledge and practice. Only through this work, more than 200 job opportunities have been created in different spheres. I also wonder how many job opportunities will be created if such a center is built in all parts of my country. This greenhouse is a representation for Ethiopia's floral from the mountain to the valley. I look at the plants of my country set in an area that covers 3,200 square meters. It includes more than 230 indigenous and non-native plant species. There are also 15 plants in the center that are rarely found in Ethiopia. Jasmine, Chetimwood, Ndahulla, Thyme, Berbera, Atat, Alashume, and Grawa. Now, this place represents a mountain in the center. The climatic condition also ranges from frosty to highland weather. Even the planted seedlings grow within these conditions. Like all the mountains of my country, here a river source originates and flows all the way through the desert. The measure of beauty is just nature. This natural composition created by the connection of one plant with the other plainly shows the beauty and grace that my country is blessed with. 
Witnessing the entire thing from here and being in the midst of such a cluster of plants is also enormously pleasing for the soul. The spring that originates in the mountains becomes a river and flows through, capturing one sentiment. While at origin it may seem small, along the path it gets stronger, advances to its destination. In this greenhouse, you can find everything from small plants to giant forest trees. Apart from different species of plants, Different varieties are also available at the center, which originates from a single plant. Therefore, this actually shows many forms in one name, just like my country. Now, the frosty mountain plants have told me that I have reached the lowland area after passing through the frosty mountain, highlands and temperate zones respectively. Unlike leaves of the highland area, those found in the lowland are smaller. The weather has become hot. The frankincense tree and the cactus species confirm that we have reached the desert. The river, which is watering the plants across the valley and penetrates into the sand when it reaches the desert. This river originates in Ethiopia. It travels across Ethiopia. It seems like the Awash River that does not flow out of Ethiopia. Unity Park Botanical Center has revealed the beauty of nature which is filled with many ecosystems, many plants, different climate and captivating flowers, grasses, ivy, flowers, medicinal and aromatic plants, fruit plants, forest trees are all available in the center. To maintain the climate of the botanic center and to keep the plants moist, sprinklers periodically spray water throughout. This botanic center also has a special area where visitors and researchers can get a detailed explanation about the various plants contained in the center. Numerous seed varieties are also on exhibit in the center, and more than 175 plant seeds are kept here. The beauty of nature is miraculous. Someone who enters here does not come out easily. For this reason, Unity Park Botanic Center is a true place to observe Ethiopia from a botanical point of view. <laughs>